Well, that was all the news that we had for the day. And as we wrap up the show, the oldest barber shop in the world, True Fit and Hill, has made its mark in India with 65,000 a year for the royal membership. Avan finds out the story behind the barber shop that serviced clients like Fred Astaire and Frank Sinatra in the past. Take a look. In today's fast-paced world, a shave at home takes no more than two minutes. But luxury grooming isn't just isolated to women. Men too want to enjoy the luxury of a royal shave in a plush barber shop with well-dressed staff. True Fit and Hill, a men's grooming barber shop, has brought the experience from Bond Street to Bombay. Krishna Gupta, Managing Director, now joins in. Now, Krishna, the brand really transports you to another era. We're talking about staff and waistcoats, wood as part of the decor, there's the Baroque wallpaper. Can you tell us more about bringing this franchise down to India and the brand? So, uh, when we first had the idea, I had seen a niche in the market and uh, there was a gap somewhere where a brand like this and a concept like this for men's grooming, uh, especially luxury and high-end men's grooming would be something that would work in India. But once we came across True Fit and Hill, uh, went through the entire legacy, uh, the fact that they've groomed monarchs and are associated with the royal family, we knew it would be the best fit for India. Well now the men's grooming market has the potential to become a 25,000 crore category by 2022. What are your views on the men's grooming market and how does True Fit and Hill plan to capitalize on this growth? So men's grooming has become extremely uh, popular and something which is more in the spotlight right now, especially uh, with influencers uh, and also the fact that we have, we have such a great infrastructure in place uh, to support people who want to come in and get themselves groomed. And Krishna, there's so much competition in the sector. Luxury grooming items are being provided online. How do you plan to stand out? Uh, for True Fit and Hill, there isn't as much competition. The major chunk of the competition lies with more mass products and products in the price ranges of 500 to 1500 rupees. Uh, True Fit and Hill products are at an average of 3500 rupees going up to 25,000 rupees for certain gift sets and for certain shaving accessories. Uh, so in that sense, we we don't have any competition as such. So currently, how many barber shops do we have in India and overseas and what are the expansion plans? Uh, currently in India, we have 12 outlets. Uh, we have five in six in Bombay right now. We have two in Delhi. We have uh, two in Bangalore, one in Hyderabad and one in Ahmedabad. Uh, we are looking to open up uh, another four in the next two months itself. Uh, one in Calcutta, one in Jaipur, one in Chennai and one in Pune. Beyond that, our goal uh, by 2020 is to reach uh, 35 stores all across the country. And we also have six other territories. Uh, we are opening up a franchise in uh, Bangladesh and we are in further talks with some, somebody in Sri Lanka and in Myanmar as well. Can I let you go without telling us some tips on men's grooming? Always use a pre-shave oil before you shave. Your son will see the difference and understand why it's so important 10 years from now. Uh, always come to True Front Hill for a shave. Okay, point taken. Thanks very much Krishna for giving us uh, details and all the very best. So clearly True Fit and Hill doesn't leave you wanting for luxury when it comes to men's grooming.